Hi, my name is Steve Natale, and I'm the product manager for Disconnect Switches and Operating Mechanisms. Today I'm here to discuss our new Disconnect Switch, TSIS VLS. In this slide, you see our typical combination motor controller. This consists of a motor disconnect switch, along with motor branch circuit protection, a motor controller, and motor overload protection. In the following slides, we're going to discuss both UL508 and UL98. You need to remember the UL508 is now replaced by UL60947-4-1. Here we have our UL508 offer, which consists of mini Vario motor disconnect switch from 10 amps to 16 amps. We also have the full version Vario motor disconnect switch from 10 amps to 115 amps. We have an enclosed version of the MD enclosed motor disconnect switch only in two versions, 30 amps and 60 amps. But our new TSIS VLS motor disconnect switch, rated UL60947-4-1, is rated from 16 amps to 63 amps. As you can see in this slide, it's applied to motors, not the panel disconnect switch, but the motor disconnect switch. Now I'd like to talk to you about the UL98 disconnect switches. These are for panel mounting disconnect switches. You have our GS1 and GS2 fusible disconnect switches ranging from 30 amps to 800 amps. We also have a NEMA class 9422 fusible and non-fusible switches ranging from 30 amps to 400 amps. We also have a TSIS non-fusible disconnect switch, our LK4 offer from 30 amps all the way up to 1200 amps. But today our newest, latest and greatest VLS disconnect switch, UL98 rated, is from 63 amps to 125 amps. This is a picture of the overall view of all of the components, both the switches, the handles, the mechanisms, auxiliary poles, auxiliary switches, shafts, terminal covers, and fuse holders. This gives you a view of the sizes of the offer and the small size, it's the 16 amp to 63 amp in the top left side of the pictures, along with the 63 amp to 125 amp UL98 rated and a larger frame size. Then you have the door mounted versions. We wanted to make ordering this product very simple. There's three core parts that you need to know. There's a switch that you have to order, a shaft, and then a handle. You could add auxiliaries, poles, groundings, neutral poles. We have all the accessories at the bottom that you see in the screen. There's also changeover switches and multiple pole disconnects six pole and eight pole. Here you have the door mounted version, even easier to order. You have a switch and a handle that adapts to your door. Same auxiliaries, same extra poles that are on the bottom of the screen are available as well. You just got to choose the one that fits the switch that you purchase. Here you see the three pole disconnect switches ranging from 16 amps to 125 amps. You have the DIN rail mounted version that's on the left side as well as the size 2 DIN rail version on the right picture. All of the commercial references are shown in that box which also highlights the different UL standards that it complies with. It's UL60947-4-1 or UL98. At the bottom of the screen you see that the physical size of this, these switches is extremely compact. The TSIS VLS 3-pole disconnect switch available in DIN rail mounting has two phys physical sizes to cover the full range. The 63 amp version can be as small as 36 millimeters wide. It also comes with a padlockable mechanism included right on the handle, as you can see in the picture above. This also has an orange tab on the back of the device which secures it to the DIN rail very tight so it doesn't slide around. These two units can be easily linked together for a 6-pole switch or an 8-pole switch changeover. Also featuring a quick snap-on handle ranging from 16 amps to 40 amps. That handle only requires you to drill one pilot hole on the outside of your door. You could also choose different style handles that have screw fixing, which will require five holes to be drilled. These are very compact size and very powerful devices. The VLS three-pole door mounted disconnect switch is UL60947-4-1 rated, and you can see the part numbers below on your screen. Here you see the different accessories that are mounted directly to the switch. You have terminal covers at the top, 
forth poles or ground or neutral poles mounted right to the side, along with auxiliary contacts on the left. You can see that there's multiple accessories that can mount on top of one another, making it very unique and very easy to use. Here you have an overview of the VLS Disconnect Switch's handles. These are door coupling, padlockable handles, all rated NEMA 112, 3R, 4, and 4X. On the, far left, on the far left, you have our flush design offer, followed by a four screw fixing to your panel door handle, followed by a black hole fixing, defeatable or not, handle. That is the hole fixing one on the previous slide that was a simple snap on, only requiring one hole to be drilled. Next to that, you have our changeover switch handle, which has the source one position off and source two position. We also have a very small compact 48 millimeter square handle available, as you see in the red and yellow. We have a pistol grip handle that is also defeatable and requires a different shaft design, but a very rugged design. At the very bottom of the screen, you see a hole pattern drill out. That is on every single handle that we have, making it very easy to retrofit any handle that you have today without having to drill a new hole pattern. Here you see our disconnect switch handles, the shafts that are applied with them. There's a five millimeter shaft extension that applies to every single switch available. It's in lengths of 150 millimeters, 300 millimeters, and 500 millimeters. At the bottom, you see the shaft that's only for use with our pistol grip handle. This also requires a separate little connector handle that you see at the bottom, VLSH A7. That will replace the existing handle that's on the switches. This shaft comes in two lengths, 150 and 300 millimeters. The pistol grip is only available for the size two disconnect switches, ranging from 63 amps to 125 amps. Our disconnect switches use the DIN rail and door mount versions up to 63 amps for size one. They're padlockable handles and they also have a quick thread ring and rotation proof indentation on the back of the handle. Again, all rated NEMA type 1, 12, 3, 3R, 4, and 4X. The disconnect switches also offer a manual line changeover. Source one, off, and source two. As you can see in the picture below, this one uses the small versions, the size one, ranging from 16 amps to 63 amps. This permits you to make combinations from a standard switch for both versions, the DIN rail or door coupling. And it's possible to put snap-on poles on each side as well. Here you see our terminal covers. They are snap-on mounting, consisting of four part numbers for both rear and door mount types. There's a part number for the single pole and a part number for the three pole solution. Two sizes to fit with all of the power pole units. Here you see our new fuse holder. We've never had this offer before. This is a great accessory that easily mounts to the bottom of the small size switches for a connection downstream of the 16 amp to 32 amp solution. The fuse sizes are a 10 by 38 class CC type up to 30 amps. Fuse isolation when the door is open and the door when the door is locked in the on position, you cannot open the fuse holder, making it safe. Here you see the tools that we have today for our offer. Go check out our webpage, catalog, handout, and we have a visual product configurator tool that makes it simple to select your disconnect switch and your handles, along with CAD drawings as well. Thank you very much for attending our TSS VLS Disconnect Switch presentation.